All right, guys, welcome back to Assassin's Creed 4. Uh, thank you so much for all the support on the first few videos. I'm thinking that we're supposed to meet this guy. I'm just gonna jump off. Hello? So far, this game, I already like it better than the last few games that they've had. I know it's like this. I don't know which installment it is. I know it's been more than just four Assassin's Creed games. I haven't played every single one of those Brotherhood and a few others that uh, don't really have like a number behind it, but. Man, it, it, for what it is, it's a great follow-up to three. If I'm supposed to meet this, I think we're still in the first sequence, but I'm not 100% sure. I don't think I have to be stealthy, though, so we should be fine. But if you guys want, I can keep spamming you guys with this. Just keep dropping those likes, and I'll definitely continue. about the sugar. I've only one pair of hands. Oh, it's no great loss. Uh, I've got uh, plenty of cargo here to make a profit on my trip. Will you stay here long? For a few weeks, yes. Then back to Barbados, to the tedium of domesticity. Don't settle for tedium. Sail for Nassau. Live life as you see fit. <laughs> Haven't I heard that Nassau is crawling with pirates? Seems a very tawdry place. Not tawdry, liberated. Oh, God. That would be an adventure. But no. No, I'm a husband and a father. I have responsibilities. Life can't be all pleasure and distraction, Duncan. Hey, our bonnet. The name's Edward, in truth. Duncan's only a handle. Ah. Secret name for your secret meeting with the governor. The governor, right. I think I've kept him waiting long enough. Mission complete? Really? So that I guess that was the whole entire second thing. Anyways. I forgot to go to him after that next thing. So I, I do think it's really awesome how this game's broken up. It's just like Assassin's Creed 3. And uh, by that, I mean that the missions, you kind of go and you know what you're about to get into before it even happens. Because you kind of just can free roam anywhere. And I'm actually going to be taking requests. If you guys want to see any parts of this game that I'm not going to, just leave a comment below. But so far, what's been your favorite Assassin's Creed game before this one? I think I, I, I was a really huge fan of the first one. Like, I, I played that, then I played the second one, but... As far as, uh, as far as the last few, I wasn't too crazy about 3, even though it had a fantastic, like, play style about it. This kind of follows that, but it also has what seems to be a better story. This one's a little more interesting. I haven't read any reviews, either. I'm just gonna take it easy. Just take it easy. There's side activities for carry the courier, excuse me. I almost slipped up on that word. I haven't seen any animals yet. I know there's like four different locations in this game. Right now we're still in Havana. If I run, hopefully uh, I don't draw too much attention to myself. Right now I'm hauling ass. Look at this. I haven't shown you guys yet. Hang on. Let me show you some of the stuff that they have on the menus. Obviously we're going way over here. It'll probably show like... Set marker. You can't fast travel, so... <laughs> I was about to say, can you? Yeah, that's just the missions. Okay. But yeah, I was going to show you the uh, little progress tracker, stuff like that. So right now, we're... 2% sync. We got a long way to go. Edward upgrades. Haven't got too many. So you pretty much purchase it as it goes. But I don't have too much money at all, so you kind of start out with a low budget. You gotta, you know, buy the BS weapon at the start of every game like this. You get challenges, and then the, you get the database. Still in the first sequence, so. But yeah, I, I do think this will be a long game. Uh, what I'll try to do is, since we have a lot of people watching this series now, I'm gonna do my best to really have videos scheduled every day for you guys. Until it's over. Dears, Mr. Duncan Walpole of England to see the governor. 
I believe he is expecting me. Sí, señor Walpole. Entre, por favor. Walking in through the front gate, that's unusual. Ese es el hombre? El ¿Cómo lo llamabas? ¿Asesino? Sí, Duncan Walpole. Debería haber llegado hace muchos días. No me gusta que los extranjeros se paseen por nuestra vida. No me fío de I thought I was being escorted. Yeah, I am. Okay. I was expecting to have more of a conversation, but I think it's picking up. The subtitles are being picked up from everywhere. Let's check what this says. Hang on. You know what I do like is you can actually go and exit. You can exit the story at any time and just go explore around the office where you work. Which is really badass. Good morning, sir. Would I be correct in thinking you are done? I am indeed. I thought as much. Woods Rogers. A pleasure. The same. I must say, my wife has a terrible eye for description. I'm sorry. My wife. You met her some years ago at the Percy's Masquerade Ball. Ah. Quite. She called you devilishly handsome. Obviously, a lie to stoke my jealousy. <laughs> Julianne, our guest of honor has arrived, Mr. Duncan Walpole. <sighs> Julianne Ducasse, <laughs> I hope your conversion to our order is an honest one. I have no love for assassins, but even less for liars. I have not come to disappoint. <laughs> Up for a bit of sport, Duncan? The old man isn't ready just yet. You've got my two best pairs of matched pistols, Duncan. So handle them with care. If I had eight, I'd treat each as my own son. Pull off a few shots if you like. Get a feel for it. <laughs> I once fought beside a man who carried nine on his purse. They were a good in battle, but hindered his ability to swim. <laughs> this guy's... I'm, I'm being blocked by that little barrel thing or whatever that is. See, there's no reason to do the style shooting like that. Just kind of waste ammo that way. So far, the shooting feels like an upgrade from the last game. Duncan, how about a true challenge? Oh shit. Does this guy look like the guy from Red Dead Redemption or is that just me? Duncan, where are your wrist blades? I've never seen an assassin so ill equipped. Ah, damaged sadly beyond all repair. Uh huh. Have your choice. Where did you find all these? <laughs> I did not find them. I took them. These are souvenirs. <laughs> Two blades. As is the custom, we. Oui? Custom, aye. Duncan, will you indulge us with a demonstration of your... Techniques. Well, uh... We must. We put together a training course in anticipation of your arrival. It would be a shame to leave here without seeing you in action. Yes, of course. Well, I mean, if there is time, I would gladly, uh... show you what I know. Here. You see? Situation is well suited to your skills. Have a go! A blade in a crowd is always the simplest. Nothing grandiose. Just quick and clean. Here we go. Damn, taking him down like a boss. I was about to actually kill one of his real guards. Really? So you... Okay, they want to see the haystack one. Well, there's got to be one near that. 
Let's go way over here. So what I was gonna say is, uh, I, I don't know if each video will be broken into a mission, but it'll be broken into a pretty good chunk of the gameplay. I'm trying to do 15, 20 minute videos for you guys. The advantage of surprise cannot be overstated, isn't that so? Especially around a blind corner. The assassins have trained you well, Duncan. You chose a perfect time to leave them behind. Look at, at the feather hat. Imagine, Jesus! Betraying the assassins is never good for one's health. Well, neither is drinking liquor, but I am drawn to its dangers all the same. And what is your business here, sir? Are you an associate of the governor's, or a pending acquaintance like myself? Guns, blades, cannons, grenados. <laughs> Anything that may kill a man, I am happy to provide. A smuggler of sorts. And how is your wife these days, Captain Rogers? Is she, uh, here? In Havana? I trust she's well, but I wouldn't know. I've been in Madagascar some 14 months hunting pirates. It took some work to dislodge the criminals there, but we managed it. In future, I hope to use these same tactics throughout the West Indies. And how did you deal with that kind? Very simply. Most pirates are as ignorant as apes. I merely offered them a choice. Take a pardon and return to England penniless, but free men. Or be hanged by the neck until dead. Oh. I imagine Nassau would be your next target. Very astute, Duncan, indeed. Best of luck with that. Grandmaster Torres! Mr. Duncan Walpole has arrived. See. You were expected one week ago. Apologies, Governor. My ship was set upon by pirates. We were scuttled. I arrived only yesterday. Unfortunate. Forgive my caution, but were you able to salvage from these pirates the items you promised me? Uh, yes, sir. I was. Assassins have more resources than I had imagined, but not nearly enough to deter us. It is a pleasure to meet you at last, Duncan. You are most welcome. Come, gentlemen. We have much to discuss. Convened at last, and in such continental company. England, France, Spain, citizens of sad and corrupted empires. But you are Templars now, the secret and true legislatures of the world. Please, hold out your hands. Mark and remember our purpose. To guide our wayward souls till they've reached a quiet road. Guide all wayward desire till impassioned hearts are cool. To guide all wayward minds to safe and sober thought. By the Father of Understanding's light, let our work now begin. Decades ago, the Council entrusted me with the task of locating in these West Indies a forgotten place our precursors once called the Observatory. See here. Look upon these images and commit them to memory. They tell a very old and important story. For two decades now, I have endeavored to locate this Observatory, a place rumored to contain a tool of incredible utility and power. It houses a kind of armillary sphere, if you like. A device that would grant us the power to locate and monitor every man and woman on Earth, whatever their location. Only imagine what it would mean to have such a power. With this device, there would be no secrets among men. No lies, no trickery. Only justice, pure justice. This is the Observatory's promise, and we must take it for our own. Do we know its whereabouts? We will soon. For in our custody is the one man who does, a man named Roberts, once called a sage. It has been 45 years since anyone has seen a true sage. Can you be sure this one is authentic? We are confident he is. 
The assassins will come for him. Indeed they will. But... Thanks to Duncan and the information he has delivered... ...the assassins won't be a problem for much longer. All will be made clear tomorrow, gentlemen... ...when you meet this age for yourselves. Until then... ...let us drink. Let us find the observatory together. For with its power, kings will fall, clergy will cower, and the hearts and minds of the world will be ours. Wow. All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you guys want more today, I definitely will be cranking out plenty of these videos. So uh, with that being said, thanks for the likes, support, everything else, and you guys stay classy.